Hello, friends. It's Christmas Eve, and I'm running behind. What else is new? Okay. <laughs> the Cheesy McCheesy smiles on because I'm running behind. I haven't done my chartreuse board. All right. I got to calm down. I got to show you guys my house. I am wearing my new boots. Ta-da! I am wearing my tights. They're not new. Semi-new. I got them a long time ago. I forgot about them. And I'm wearing my Ioni lashes. I'm wearing my Dollar Tree um, necklace. Because you got to be tacky McTacky. This is like the day just to let it rip. You know? The ring. And I got my earrings on. I got my fake hair on. And this is a jumper that I bought like from Fashion Nova before they went like crazy expensive. And it's cute. It's just like little culottes. And it has a v-neck and it has like a little um if you want to be sexy i mean i can open it up but like my stepsons are gonna be here so you know i don't want to give them nightmares oop i gotta put that back great now i'm not gonna be able to get it open back should never have unbuttoned it okay um yeah so it's just like a cool lot very in style like this type of jumper is in style and i like it it's comfortable it's got the i've got my dynasty um shoulder pads on I feel like Alexis and Dynasty. Um, I feel total 80s. All right, so outfit for Christmas Eve. And we're going to start. I don't know if I should start the tour right now. No, let me see. Hold on. Hold on. Can we just all admire Miss Fancy in her dress? Oh, of course, she goes over there. Mama, come over here. Say hi. Hi. Look at those pretty, look at that pretty girl. She's got her hair did. There, so you guys can see her. She's going to eat. Look at, hi, mamita. All right, it starts as soon as you come up. We have the rugs from just DT, little cheapy ones, because it's been raining. So we put these out, and then we have the nice one. I think this is Ray Dunny. Merry Christmas. I don't know if this is Ray Dunny or Aldi. It could be either or. I don't remember. Then we have our little light lantern, and we have the umbrella. We have, that's from Dollar Tree. Dollar Tree. You can't see our poinsettias. You can see, oh, you can see the poinsettias a little bit. And then I saved the wreath, and it has, the wreath hanger is from Hobby Lobby. And there's my big wreath. So, yeah. And there we go. Alright, so we're going to walk in. You know, I would do the live wreath again. I would just flock the flock out of it. I mean, my husband flocked it, and it came out perfect. So, I would do it again. All right, and when you enter, you're going to be in our small foyer. And I did a lot with a little. All right. We have this whole double tier tray is from Target. And we just have, like, little simple things. These are from the 99 cent store, I think, like, a couple years ago. This is just an ornament, and I took off the little tag and I thought it would be cute because this is just a small delicate tray and that was also an ornament but it says fresh cut what does it say greens and then you have like Santa Claus you have the globe from the Dollar Tree and then I put um a red bow to cover the heart and then when I'm talking about space fillers like that tag is from Dollar Tree we have the gray gnome from Dollar Tree and the snowman from Dollar Tree he's actually in the wrong spot but and then we also have um, Santa Claus. And then these are from Target, these little guys. I decided to put the moose in front of, trying to make it like a reindeer. And then, of course, this is from DT. And then I just use these from DT to hold all of our, we have a lot of keys. And I try to get more lighting behind him. But he's um, he's the little bear. And then... This is, of course, from DT. This is from Wally Mart. Let me get up here. This is from Walmart. And then up, you'll just see that we just, I just hung up the two vintage from Walmart. They look really, really cute. And then um, on our door, we have lots of bells. As you can see, we have an elf hanging. This is from Hobby Lobby. We have Miss Fancy right there. 
This is from Ross. Loving it. It worked out perfect. We washed it. It came out great. We have a lot of rugs right now because it's raining. All right, a lot's going on here. And this is from Hobby Lobby. And then I put lights and I did my whole um, Christmas floral. I put that little um, bulb right there because it blinks and gives off so much light. I just thought it would be like a good backspacer and it is it's it's giving off a lot of light this is this silver lantern is really really cute that's from the 99 cent store from a long time ago i was gonna put a bow on it but it, because it's so glittery it's come i just kind of want to leave it alone as a matter of fact i kind of want to put this down and then these are little lights they're going to be going out soon but i decided to put them here i'm kind of going for like a rustic look down here and there's the squirrel from um tarjay these are these pine cones are actually ours. My, my husband actually sprayed those. And then um, more of the lanterns, more of like the little lights. And I have a swag there. And then you have a little deer back there. And then you have kind of like a space filler back there. So let me back up. So it's like a lot going on in a little area, and we we don't have a big area. Like, that's all the fancy stuff, like her leashes and braces and all that. So, yeah. All right. Then I'm just going to come over here, and I have my gnome. I have a tree that lights up. And this is from actually Dollar Tree, like, or 99 cents. So it's just like little signs. These are the little um, lanterns from Dollar Tree. And I like those because if something gets knocked off in this area, which it could be because Fancy jumps up, I really don't have to worry about what's going on. Like, you know, he's from the 99 cent store. I think I bought this at Dollar Tree and I put pine cones in there, the Dollar Tree trees, little signs. Like, these little moose, they're from um, Target. Like, I don't have to worry about anything breaking. This is actually from LTD Commodities. And what I like about it is this is the wreath. Oops, I don't want to drop anything because everything's everything's so tightly packed in. But you turn it around, and like during January or March, it's farmhouse. It change the blocks change with the seasons, so that was well worth it. And again, again, that's LTD commodities. So right now it's carrying the wreath, and I try and keep this as simple as possible because, like I said, we have Miss Fancy here. All right, then I did like Ray Dunn, I believe. We did Vintage, Santa's Workshop pointing that way. So yeah. And then these are from the 99 cent store. Follow the law, of course, like um, Bath and Body. And this is all of Fancy's area. And trust me, I cleaned the baseboards, but yeah, I'm not gonna even get into a hard just to keep Fancy's areas clean. All right, so that's that. And then, like I said, ignore that basket. Nothing I can do about that basket. Okay, and the dining room, you guys have seen a million times. It's all lit up. I even lit up my little balloon. Oops, we forgot to put our mop away. Sorry. Um, yeah, we, we totally cleaned the house and so forth. You know, let me put that mop away. It's bugging me. I don't want to do that before the boys come. This one bought me beautiful flowers, blue and white and silver. And... This is how the table looks all lit up, and I like the balloon from the OC. So really, really kitty, pretty kitty, pretty. And I really didn't know where to put this because I don't have any room for it, but it's so pretty for five dollars. And yeah, so I didn't do a whole bunch of lighting here, but it does look pretty at night. So that's that, and. You guys have seen this, so I'll keep going. All right, so this is kind of like my Pioneer Woman area. I put lights in her boot. This is from last year, and you can see that the boot has, like, um, lights on the outside. And I threw some lights in there, and there's even um, ornaments in there. And I put Baked with Love. I have a snowman. I have her little trivet. Like, all this, all in the back is Pioneer Woman. And I, that's from Big Lots, the Vintage. This is from LTD Commodities, the red truck, the salt pepper shakers, and then I also use that house from um, Target, and then I put Mrs. Claus Kitchen, 
And then we have the little red truck with the toothpicks. And then I found, I forgot this. This is actually from Wally Mart. So I put that right there. And then these trivets are Christmas, Merry Christmas, Home for the Holidays, Christmas Bake Shop. And then I have a little red truck right here as a little trivet. And then the little gnome. So did that. And then over here, I don't have a lot of space. So I put all of my little canisters. As you can see, it's already done out. We even have the gingerbread little wax melt. These tins are from Dollar General. This teal truck I change out with the seasons. Like right now, it's holding our napkins gingerbread little towel in case we need another towel and also has like the another towel behind it that's like the little gnome towel so that's how I did that and then I have I always have a bunch of towels this is really how I arrange them they're just kind of thrown right now sorry you guys and then I did use this for from the 99 cent store and so I really like the hot cocoa ones so I need three right now and then these are kind of like just kind of decor and then these are the ones like that we use to, like mop up stuff and so forth so anyways all right that's that I'm trying to think of is there anything else um in the kitchen not really um got this big magnet to put on the bottom of our fridge and it's the red truck and then we have like rugs and so forth we, we put a lot of rugs down because it was of the rain so that was kind of you know the big thing and then right now we're getting ready, like, I don't know if, yeah, like this is like the salsa, like we're, we're going to do a buffet style. This is the vintage from Cracker Barrel. I have this because it's, since it's a hot cocoa station and coffee station, and you know, like I don't want to always be mopping. Well, I do mop, mop. I do wipe down my counters all the time. All right. These are really cute. We'll be using these today. This is going to be like for dessert. I'm going to put these napkins out as well. Super cute. Held on to them. Oh, wait. Hold on. Hold on. And I put my hot cocoa sign up so you guys can kind of get like a lot more lighting. Um, this is really cute and I use it as a utensil holder. It's actually a canister, but I put all my utensils in there and you can see I have like my little vintage um spatula down here the ones from dollar tree and what i did to get them to stay together is i just put like a i, I, I actually tied them and then you have baking spirits bright and then i've been drinking out of the santa claus my coffee we have the gnomes with the mush mushrooms with all of the marshmallows our candy canes you have the elf i didn't know what to do with the elf so i put the hot cocoa sign on there for today i have the vintage um snowman and as you guys can see i'm working with very limited space so like i wanted to do a whole lot this one is ray dunny hot cocoa this one's another baking spirits bright so i have a lot going on like in a very tiny space but i do what i can um and also like i really didn't have time to make it as cute as i want because you guys all know that i've just been like so busy lately like just a maniac so anyways let's go out I'll show you the rest. On the flip side is my bar, which I'm always talking about. Now, I'm going to tell you the truth. This is not the best I've done with the bar because I just had so much stuff and I really had to make it work. All right. This I found at a thrift store. It's from Hallmark and it says Christmas 1974. It's a beautiful plate and we found it. Um, I found it at a thrift store up in Julian. My husband took me up to Julian. This is Mary. This is Ray Dunn. I bought that. This is from Hobby Lobby, that white tree back there, the gnome, Christmas treats, cookies for Santa. That's from the 99 cent store. I put that up on a riser. Here are the trucks, and I put them around the, gin the marshmallow some more guy. Here you have jingle bells. You have peppermint mocha. I have the candles in between them. I have the gnome. And then I, I always keep a little bit of Patriot patriotic stuff out so we have our tree which lights up and it's red white and blue i also kept out my red white and blue camper and then i have this red and white really cute um canister as well and then i put this is from hobby lobby and i just did some floral and i put a gnome so it's kind of all flows together and this is what i meant how i put 
um, bows on my bar stools just to kind of dress them up. Simple, easy, cheap. This is my, this is Lennox. We, we forgot to put this away. I'm going to hide this right here. Sorry, you guys. Um, anyways, I just think it adds a cute little touch. And then, you know, you don't spend a whole bunch of money. That's Fancy's little area right there. So we don't put like any plugins right there. But anyways, that's what I did with that. And um, it just makes it really easy. So yeah. All right, coming over here, I did really simple. Um, Missy, can can you move? No, no, I'll step over her. It's okay, Fancy. You don't have to move an inch. Oh my gosh, you guys. Okay, thank you, Mama. All right, so this is this double tier is from Target, and I use very small, little, little items. But let's start over here. I did a little nativity scene, and those little angels that light up are from Dollar Tree. Little nativity scene, I think. Little nativity scene, I think, is from 99 Cent Store a long time ago. I have a cross above it, and then I just have a tree that I didn't decorate. I just let it. What on earth? Okay, I just I just lit it up, and I just kind of left it very plain. Then over here, it says Candy Cane Company. And then again, I needed really small figurines to go in there. The train and the little house, that's from Cracker Barrel. The little marshmallow men, I think, are from Cracker Barrel or they're from Home Goods. That little present that lights up, I think, is from the 99. And then those globes are from Dollar Tree. And then, oops, oh, hold on, hold on. All right, and he lights up. And that is actually from um, Family Dollar. And then I just put two little snowmen next to him, a little tree, and a pine cone. And again, it's just, you know, I have a little area, so I wanted to be really delicate with what I did. Above it is a moose from Hobby Lobby. Above that is vintage from Walmart. And above that is a wreath from Joe Ann's. So down below, I just... I glued these together. My husband hot glued these together for me. And this is from Dollar Tree from two years ago. And I just stacked it up and I thought it looked cute. Here you have like these little glass. And I bought these this year from Dollar Tree. And then I have like these little tags that are from the 99. They're vintage. Had them for a while. So I incorporate like, uh, I mean, everything I buy, I do incorporate as much as I can. And then at the bottom, I just put like my um, holiday books facing outward. And then I put that little gingerbread tin. And then that was, that is from Dollar Tree. So you can see that I incorporate a lot of stuff. Like this home, I think was either from Target or... I think it was from Target, from the dollar spot. So there you go. Right over here, we just have like a little corner. This is little goofy guy. He's from the 99 cent store, and I have the heart to chuck him. There's nothing wrong with him. He's just goofy. Um, and I put a little red truck right there. I bought this from Walmart or Hobby Lobby. I can't remember. That little fox is from the 99 cent store way back when. And... That cozy cabin is Ray Dunn. You, I do have lights. They're just really light. This is actually a candle by Better Homes and Garden. And I wanted to put more light over here. So I stuck a tree in there just to give you guys some more light to kind of see what's going on. Then up above it, we have all the vintage. Two of those are from everything but the Bambi. I'll call it Bambi is from Walmart. These two were from Walmart, but I got a Dollar Tree. This I bought at Dollar General great deal these above here are that's walmart that's hobby lobby that's hobby lobby now let me back up and show you guys kind of how everything looks and then there's my pillows that look really really cute and i also put pillows right here except we keep opening up the sliding glass doors so they keep like moving but i kind of wanted them at an angle so you can kind of see them. Not, yeah, let me put them. But this, yeah, we're going to be side. The sunglass doors will just move. So then I have, I have to do our stockings. This is crystal stocking, Victoria's Secret. And I put, I have to do our stockings, you guys. But all of our little throws are right here. In case you're cold, you can get nice and cozy. Right here, I did my husband's little area. And I did it with old-fashioned Santa Claus and then this lights up 
and then this was an old old wreath and I spruced it up and I put some lights on it and then right here Santa Claus you have the gnomes the trees the pine cones we have the gingerbread house then over here is where like I put my four foot Santa Claus from Walmart. I also gave him a necklace and there we have the presents. And then I didn't decorate the pink tree because there's just so much going on right there that I just felt I didn't need it. You know, I really, really didn't. And then of course we have the Christmas music going. Everything is just really lit up over there. We're going to go really quick. That's from family dollar. All of these are backspacers from dollar tree. That is Hobby Lobby. These beautiful girls are from the 99 from a long time ago. They were not 99 cents. We have a lot of stuff that lights up. The presents, of course, were from, I think, Family, no, Dollar General. Then, this is from Hobby Lobby, Ray Dunn, and a lot is going on right here. Ray Dunn, the gnomes, and then I'm going to back up and show you guys the Ray Dunn gnomes. We also have the lantern with the red truck. And then coming up, we did a montage of a little bit of everything, of a little bit of everything. Up here, we have Merry Christmas, Hot Cocoa. My bonus sons are here. We also have the swag from Home Goods. And look at the tree. Here's the tree. Here, hold on, hold on. And yes, Fancy is greedy. She doesn't know whether she's happy or not. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. A lot's going on. Oh, fancy. She's a big talker. Big talker. Alright. So, thank you. And we'll bring your stuff out too. Alright, so I'm going to show the tree. I'm sorry about I'm sorry about fancy in the background, you guys. I'm so sorry. Alright, we have Be Mary. Alright, and then we have the Be Mary from Ray Dunn. We have a wreath. And all right, so let me back up to show you guys kind of how everything looks. I mean, it's it's Christmas here. There's no like you know, and yeah. So that's it's pretty cool. And of course, oh, I put that in front of our sliding glass doors. It's open right now. It feels good with the warm. So I'm just showing you guys everything, an overview. And we're going to be cozy in the den. And my husband does not want me to show you our bedroom. I will show you our tree, but I'm not going to do it now because um, I have to get our Chartusi thing going. Um, and then you guys, I mean, you guys are pretty much, I mean, I already told you, I did not have a big home. So I did not lie. <laughs> you know, like I'm not hiding stuff from you. But I will show you the master bedroom because... The tree is adorable, so I will show you that. But I'm going to sign off. I'm not going to sign off. I'll be back. All right, so for my husband, I am putting some classic flannel from Bath & Body in his stocking. I am putting Stay Positive. I can't find the other one. And I am putting Old Spice um, All Day. What is this? Body Spray. Then I got this light. It's like a refrigerator light for the Yeti. I thought he'd like that. And then... This is, of course, Bath & Body um, antibacterial soap. And then I got him a $50 gift card to Canes. So that's going to go in his um, stocking. And I'm going to save the $100 um, one to Home Depot for another time. So if you guys were wondering, this is my cute little, this is my, my quilt. I don't know what this is. I gotta figure out what that is. I gotta, you know what? I'll open it right now and we'll figure it out what it's together. But this is my little quilt. Isn't it cute, you guys? I love it. Cute, cute. Oh, my tissue box. Sorry. Real life. All right. I needed a cheap um, compact until my Mac one comes. As a matter of fact, on Sunday I need to figure out when Mac's coming because I need another one. Otherwise, I'm gonna have to go buy it, which I'll be really mad because because I'm on like an every month thing with them. Uh, delivery. So let me put this back before my husband comes in really quick. I also got him his favorite gum from Walmart. So I'll stick that in there too. So 
So he has quite the full stocking. Plus, I got him a lot more, which I'll show you guys. But his stocking's like overflowing already, so the rest is going to go. And then at Walmart, I did pick up some more um, wax melts. I had to pay $2. This was 3 but I love brownie pecan. These were two. This is brownie pecan. Yeah, I think it's all brownie pecan. $2. I spent so much money. One, two, three, four, five. That's ten. Like fourteen dollars just on freaking wax melts. Unbelievable. So I bought my husband a black Kenneth Cole and it has like everything in it. So I'm not gonna undo it. He's just gonna clean the plastic. So I'm gonna put it in a cute bag right now. And I got him a really cool, like, American flag t-shirt that's kind of like a skull. So I'm going to put that in there with the cologne. Alright, so this is my tree. Let me back up. It's not that big, but it is so me. I'll show you guys. But I have my little... She's actually... She's a... Um... Oh, there's fancies here. Oh, we just vacuumed. Anyways, there's my Hello Kitty. And let me turn on my little trees. Oh, you know, I didn't turn on my little skirt. Sorry, you guys. There's my little trees. Little. I mean, if I was a gnome, that'd be me. And then look, I also have this down here. Look, at it. it's really, really cute. And then I have another little cute Hello Kitty. And look, look how cute that is. Let me turn this baby on so you guys can see everything. Look at how pretty. Isn't that cute, you guys? And then look at I decorated a lot with pink. Noel, look at that. Fancy all the pretty little ornaments, pink glitter. So, I mean, it's not big or anything, but it is perfect for what I need it for. And it's, this is going to be turned into my Valentine's Day tree. And I'm happy. It doesn't take a whole lot for me to be happy. It really doesn't. All right, those are my husband's presents. I'm wondering if I got him enough. Okay, let's go through this really quick in my head. All right, I bought him a coat. $50 to Raising Cane's, $100 to Home Depot. Um, a shirt. Kenneth Cole. Um, cologne Collection. And a whole bunch of stuff in his stocking. I think that should be enough. But yeah. So I really, really enjoy my tree. Watch me turn you guys around. Look at that. This is what I look out every night. My little Hello Kitties. And I really don't care what anyone thinks of my home. I'm happy. I'm blessed to have food in my belly. And a loving husband. And I'm happy with my home. And everyone should be happy with what they have. And count our blessings. That's what I think, you know. And you can, and yeah, you know, the, the haters are gonna judge and be like, I'm sure I'm gonna read some interesting comments, but you know what? I opened up my house to friends of the channel and to only friends. And I said I would, and I did. So, all right, let's go make the chartoucy. All right, so I just did a simple chartoucy board. I just put some, um, olives and crackers and this is cracker barrel slices so i'm gonna put that out and let me get fancy of course is by the kitchen because she's very excited and we're putting stuff on my freezer which next year this freezer will be gone because we're gonna get a dining room set all right um anyways we're gonna eat some hors d'oeuvres and then I'll, when the tamales come out i'll show those as well and I'm going to take this over to the den. And I need to get some, um, I think the napkins will be fine. Okay. All right, and there it is. Get the comments? Yeah.
if I like green one. I've never been a fan of all this. I don't like all this by themselves. I like when they're like this. like like that. I don't know about green on ones. They're different. Well, I didn't want to do black because that doesn't make sense to do it. Well, maybe, I guess you could. Oh. And those are my bonus sons. They're very nice. Right? Well, yes, Crystal. Wonderful. Well, Christmas my Christmas is going very good, thank you. How about yours, dearest? He's happy, too. We're all happy. Everyone's happy. Okay. So, as you can see, a lot, I mean, I think it looks Christmassy. I do. I think that, yeah, I think we all got it. All right, I'm going to go because I have some more stuff to do. I'm going to drink some more um, of this, some Diet Mountain Dew because I'm kind of tired. And then I'll be back. Okay, and here are the tamales, and they're in that baking dish that I got from Dollar General. And we're going to enjoy just chit-chatting a little bit longer. So I'm going to get some foil, put it over, and keep them warm. And, yeah, so that's what's going on. And there is Miss Fancy looking absolutely devastatingly gorgeous in her count huh mommy huh look at the camera yeah look at you i know ollie was a ham but not so much fancy she's now yeah hey and we're having caesar salad and then we have the beans uh, we're going to have to remove the beans and the tamales and yeah i think that's it for right now Fancy's just over here. Hi, mommy. Begging. Begging. She got a little bit of a treat. But she's going to have a lot of good stuff in her stocking. I love that dress on her. It's so cute. No, it's Caesar salad dressing. It's Caesar. I just put it in that little. So my husband said my cake is good. That's the ambrosia I made. And then we also have the cake bites. Oh, sorry. Okay. Right, don't judge my fridge. It's the holidays. All right. There's my fudge. It's really good. I had some last night. The cake, my husband says, is good. Instead of my bonus son. And then the ambrosia salad is just so big. I'll probably have to give some away. And then here's the little cake Look at the our little cheesecake. It comes in original cheesecake, brownie, and raspberry. Ooh, yummy. Yum, yum. <laughs> oh, you know, I think I might have a little bit of my eggnog. I think I'm going to try some of my eggnog. Oh, yeah, I have my coffee. But I'm going to have a little taste of the eggnog before we go to sleep. And Fancy is hoping... Oh, I know what she wants. She wants her peppuccino. Fancy! I'm recording, by the way, so you guys... Fancy, hey, Mommy! Look at it. She looks so dainty, babe, and small. She looks a little lap dog. She looks so small. Oh, look at her dress, though. Look at that. She's so cute. I'll show you who I cover it. Good girl. She's like a big kitty cat now, huh? A barking kitty cat. She's, I love her dress. So cute. Remember one time I would never let dogs on the couch or on the bed? Or in the house. And now oh, look. Like, <laughs> look at it. Look at this one. She lives with us, sleeps with us. That's where you're at. That's just your spot. Yeah. She loves that spot right there. Oh, look, look. Oh, she loves the house looks so pretty. I like it. I, th I, th I think it came out good. I like the in front of the mantle. I think the best. What do you think? I like it. The mantle? The yeah. Santa Claus? Yeah. It's, it's cute. Bad, man. I'll go get Josh a DB gun. That's, yeah. That's nice. Anyways. There we go. You want to open your presents, babe? Uh, Should we get presents? This? You guys want to open presents? Sure. Some of your stuff? Yeah, my phone. Alright, my friends, I'm going to end it here. I'm sorry if this like was not fun or entertaining, but I hope you all are having a wonderful holiday. Merry Christmas. And if you're alone, I have spent Christmases alone. And you know what? Enjoy yourself. Spoil yourself. Eat. 
the food you want, take a long bath, do whatever makes you happy, relax in your jacuzzi, watch some good movies, and yeah, trust me, there's nothing wrong with spending Christmas by yourself, don't, I've spent, like I said, I've spent several Christmases by myself, and you know what, I either volunteered at the homeless shelter to serve food, or I just had a total, like, me day, so, um, also to those who have lost loved ones this year, please know that you're not alone, and you have my sincerest, deepest condolences, and, um, I don't want to be, like, a downer, but we do need to acknowledge that people are going through things, and, um, I think of you, and, um, I'm wishing all of you and your families an amazing Christmas. Merry Christmas, my friends. And I will see you all tomorrow. I'll do a video of what I got for Christmas. And um, also, please, check out the Dollar Tree Valentine's Day. It's the sneak peek. I mean, I'm pretty sure we're one of the very few channels that have shot that much of the... Um, valentine's and it's they brought they did a really good job of bringing in new stuff i think there's more new valentine's than there is christmas thank you so much my friends and i will see you tomorrow